lifted by uh, Stepanek. He's out of the zone. Favourable bounce. McEwen takes the line, shoots straight into Mar. There will be a face-off in the Swindon zone. Face-off in the Swindon zone. We've had uh, four minutes and 20 seconds of the first period. Will Weldon invited to leave. Nathan Pollard wins the draw. Weldon shoots it. Yes, it's in the goal. It takes a deflection. Phantoms fortunate. But that took a deflection. Ironically, Weldon's taken out of the face-off. Pollard wins it. The shot from Weldon. And it's come off the back of Whitfield, I think it is. Weldon shoots. It takes a deflection initially from off Jarvis Hunt, potentially. But uh, Weldon takes the plaudits. Phantoms first on the board. Uh, I'm sure that... Oh, dear me. That's a, a whipped shot there from the uh, bottom of the circle. I think it may be Bebre with a shot and Ma, well, traffic in front of him, so he's done well to stop it. I'm not sure he knew too much about it. Bebris getting a lot of work done this, uh, this afternoon. Ma uses his stick. James Ferrara having to control it. Bullis, oh, that comes back to uh, Bebris once more. Great play by the uh, Wildcats. It's a goal. Bebris finishes, great finish. Well worked, good interplay in the corner and uh, Bebris takes it on. Let's just see that on, a, on the replay. Whitfield, so there's two Phantoms high there and then the Phantoms, well, they've still got enough men deep. There's Bebris. Yeah, we had two guys go into one puck there, obviously. Daddy paid it, but Callum did it. Rob all went, Paddy had to step down, but it was just a little bit too late and uh, Eddie's a strong guy. He's going to... He's going to drive the net, and that's what we said earlier on about the net minder. When you've got a good net minder, you've got to drive the net, and that's exactly what Swindon just done. And it's uh, a bit like the Keystone Cops. Yes. And we've got a man out. Oh, dear me. Aaron Nell. Oh, he's missed it. Biggest cheer of the night. Padlek takes the blue line. No lane there, but... Uh, good good move, but uh, very low down. Padalek fires. Oh, and uh, Rennie Marr gets away, uh, gets the puck away. Well, I have no idea. Three on two. Hoog, Bullis, shot. Picked up by Hoog. Oh, and it's bouncing. No goal. Swindon players celebrating. No lamp lit behind the goal. And uh, Jordan Marr manages to get on top of it. Who? Bebris goes for it. Well, from here, that looks like it's easily in the crease. Yeah, I think he, I think Jordan's got that there. But this is a about eight, eight minutes of uh, hockey from both teams. The puck's bobbling all over. Not any team can make a good pass. And uh... out to Jones. Jones fires. Swindon lead. Power play goal. It's taken an awful long time for a power play marker, but the Swindon Wildcats take the lead. Out to number 11, Jones, who fires it. Um, Bullis was in front of uh, Jordan Mark. Yeah, we have, we have three guys below the red line before it comes out to Chris Jones, and James comes steaming out. He's the only guy there, and it's a it's a power play goal. I know Phantoms are going mad here, but obviously Belfit's asking the linesman what's going on, but I didn't see anything. Stepanek, two on one, big chance. Oh, it's an equaliser! Stepanek skates left, shoots right, top shelf, cliff side. Phantoms level it on the power play. Oh, I took a little bit of defection, but that's what Stepanek's there about. We need him to shoot the puck, and doesn't what when he gets a chance, he gets a chance to shoot it. But I think a few of the players were shouting past the sisters, but obviously Step knew what he was doing. I've got to say to you, we've been calling for that for 43 minutes. He skates through. He's bigger than everybody else. He's got the size. He's got the skill. Give him the puck and let him shoot. Tell him he needs to shoot. Got a battle there. Oh. Not for you, Steve. No, no, it was no. for me, I have to say. That, that, 
given what's been called tonight, I can't believe that's not been called. Bebris, Hoog, and uh, Jones is waiting at the point. 38 seconds left. It's cut, it's come out. Elias and they're waiting. Uh, he was on the blue line. Says absolutely not. The Phantoms were desperate for that call. Bullis in front of the net. Chance. Big chance. Goal. 25 seconds left in the power play. Uh, Sterling defence work for the Phantoms, but Jones, number 11, fires from the hash marks. And that's the second power play goal of the evening, I think, for the uh, Wildcats. Wildcats three, Phantoms two, seven minutes and 58 seconds left. Yeah, there was a few things that went on there, John. There was a cross check from Bebris. Uh, the blue line, we reckon it went out, but obviously they carried on going. But I say, when we penalty kill them, we can't have three guys deep. Pooh James is on the top, one on two. We're never gonna, we're never gonna defend that. 2.24 remaining. Nathan Pollard calls for it, takes it. Takes the blue line. Lydia gets there. Oh, and uh, the shot, the sweep shot there. Rennie Mar takes it, face off in the Swindon zone. 2.11 remaining. Who have you got then, folks at home? Man of the match for you. I give it to Jordan or Robbie Ferrara to be fair and I think for them I think they're going to give it to I don't know I think God, uh, Godfrey had a good game but they'll probably give it to Jones who got them two power play goals. 